Hello Collective, welcome to my channel. Thank you guys so much for being here. If you are a returning viewer, I appreciate you guys. Thank you. If you are here for the first time, welcome. Please feel free to hit the like, share, and subscribe buttons at any time. All right. We're just going to go ahead and hop into the messages to see what spirit has for you guys at this time. All right. Please remember that these will be general messages. Everything is not going to resonate for everyone. So only take what is for you. Leave the rest. Okay. Um, also, masculine and feminine energies can be switched. Roles may be reversed as it applies to your situation. And these are timeless reads. So if you find that this reading isn't resonating with you at this time, it could resonate with you later. Could it be something that you're already going through, currently going through, or something that you will go through in the near future as okay? Um, this could be someone in your energy if this isn't about you personally. So just take what resonates, okay? So let's go ahead and just dive into it. Let's see what messages are. Okay, guys. Um, personal readings are available if you guys would like a personal reading. The information will be in the description box below. See two 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 on the timer, guys. Let's get started. Send the messages right now. Holy Spirit for the collective. August 13th, 2022. What do we need to know right now? This time, this is not it. Send the messages for the collective. We have the um the lovers card, okay? Divine union. This is romance. This is a deep, powerful connection. This is a relationship. This is something coming into a alignment, divine union, okay? Gemini energy. What else? Okay, got 10 coins. I feel like it wanted to come out. These two hopped up. All right, so the Queen of Cups and the Ten of Cups, okay. Cancer, um, Pisces, Scorpio energy here, okay. You have emotionally connected, deep feelings, okay. Somebody could be very intuitive, all right. You also have two, uh, Ten of Cups, three, four, three on the timer. A storybook ending, okay. A bit more. All of this is about relationships and emotions and connections. You got the lovers, the queen of cups, and the ten of cups. Okay, somebody is about to be in a loving connection. I'm getting okay. Let's get one more. Somebody has a lot of feelings for you. Somebody wants to be with you. Can we get one more, please? I'm liking the way this is starting out already. Okay, nine of coins. Rewards for your labor. This is your reward, okay? You're about to get um, this storybook ending that you guys have been wanting, okay? You're about to meet your divine partner, your soulmate, okay? Um, this nine of coins is about abundance, okay? It's about things falling into place. It's about alignment, all right? Um, wish fulfillment. Okay. Virgo energy here. Um, I, I just feel like 
everything that you wanted, that you've been manifesting, that you've been waiting on. It's about to happen. I just saw five zero zero on the timer. Okay, guys. Oh man, like major changes, new beginnings and things like that. Okay. Like this is a divine union. This is a connection with somebody. You're about to get your, your partner, um, your divine partner. You're about to reap the benefits of the, the seeds that you have been sowing, okay? Um, things are about to start happening and, and moving and coming into fruition for you. You're about to start seeing results, okay? That's what I heard. Thank you, Spirit. You're about to start seeing results, all right, guys? You have temperance here on the top. Perfecting balance. Something is coming into balance here. Things are balancing out. Things are working out in your favor. Five, five, five on the timer, guys. Okay. Like, oh my gosh, this is two becoming one. Okay. More harmony. Harmonies here twice. Okay. Balance. Peace. Like your life's purpose. Some of you guys are following your life's path. You got the fool card here. Okay. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Sagittarius. You could be a Sagittarius. You have Gemini here, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Virgo, okay? Um, Taurus energy as well. But, y'all, the new beginning. Things are coming into balance. You're about to come into union with somebody here who wants to, who, somebody who's planning for you. Somebody could be planning a future with you, Okay. Or this is what's happening in your future, okay? You could be making plans with somebody or somebody's making plans for you to be with you, to come towards you, okay? You have the will of fortune here, okay? Somebody is very sure about you. This is your destiny. This is your karma. This is, you know, your your um, divine purpose I'm getting, okay? Like it's your time now, all right? The sun, yeah, all types of, oh my goodness, this is like the best card, the happiest card in the deck. This is full of happiness, positivity, um, lots of good, positive energy, abundance, happiness, okay, guys? King of Cups is here. Oh my goodness gracious. King of Cups is here. <laughs> Looking for this, this Queen of Cups. Lots of feelings, lots of emotions here, okay? But lots of feelings, lots of love, lots of emotions, lots of everything. Divine masculine. Okay? Your divine counterpart. This is um somebody is ready to take action towards you. Somebody is ready for stability. Somebody's ready to um I'm here and be head of the household. I just heard head of household. So somebody's ready for all of that. Look, ace of swords on the bottom of the deck. That's the truth. Somebody has come to some sort of uh, clarity, okay, truth about what they want, about this divine union, okay? Yeah, somebody could have walked away from um, a liar, somebody that betrayed them or cheated on them. Somebody could have walked away from this person, okay? And now they are about to um, find emotional fulfillment in you, okay? They left somebody out in the cold here. They could have had a decision to make. Um, between two people or a decision about whether to leave or whether to stay. I feel like they left, but just this right here is, is lovely. Okay. The lovers, the queen of cups, ten of cups, and the nine of coins. The, the fool one is not here. Okay. This is a new beginning. Happiness. I see um, lots of traveling okay for somebody vacations okay um somebody could be getting on a plane going somewhere i just heard overseas i'm heard like jamaica the caribbean or something like that virgin islands i just heard okay so yeah somebody could be um taking a trip okay somebody feels very free like you can be yourself i'm also getting self-love okay but somebody um, definitely feels like they can be themselves with you and vice versa. 939, I just saw on the timer, guys, okay? All right, let's get some. Um, they have eight of wands. Look, I just said somebody's going to be taking a trip. Look at that. 
you get all the flames and, and stuff in the sky, okay? Yeah, things are about to take off for you in a positive direction. I'm uh, just heard just you wait. Just sit back and wait, okay? Things are about to take off for you guys in a positive direction. Spirit is saying, just wait. I'm about to show you some things here, okay? Yeah. All right. Something could have um, happened. There was a tower moment somewhere, okay? That could have been um, this person walking away from that situation. Yeah, 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 yeah. Something ended for sure. So this is you or, or somebody that's coming towards you. Something ended abruptly, like the, like it was a big change in their life. Like somebody did some shit and they broke up, divorced, whatever, whatever. But anyway, let's clarify what we have here. I just saw 1122 on the timer, guys. 1122. Let's clarify the lover. Damn. Oh, damn. <laughs> I didn't need to get it out. Ten of Cups and the Eight of Wands. Shit. Okay. Ten of Cups here twice, guys. Okay. Ten of Cups here twice. Storybook ending. This is a happy ending. Okay. This is um a family, a new beginning. This is what's coming towards you. Eight of Wands, okay? Eight of Wands, we ended up with on the top of this deck here, okay? With the Hierophant, okay? Ceremony, um, this is, could be a marriage, okay? That could be what's coming towards you guys. This Ten of Cups, a happy family, happy life, all right? Damn, y'all about to get y'all divine counterpart, y'all. Shit, I didn't even get the words out. Yeah, look, Ace of Pentacles. This is about a new person, new opportunities. This is about, also about meeting someone new. Okay, 1221 on the timer, guys. Can't make it up. Look, and they wanted to fall out. Okay, we'll, we'll keep it. For some of you, you have a new person coming in your life, honey. Could be um, a Virgo Taurus or a Capricorn. All right. Could be a Pisces. Okay, could be a, a Sagittarius for some of you, okay? Or a Gemini, or these are your signs. Take what resonates. Holy, let's see what this Queen of Cups is talking about. Yeah, somebody's just going to have a whole lot of feelings for you, or they already do, okay? You could already be in union with this person. This could be your confirmation. Oh, damn. Ace of Cups. Clarifying the Queen of Cups. All these emotions, deep feelings, okay? Somebody also, again, very empathic, very intuitive here, okay? This is going to be a highly protected union, I feel like. Um, yeah, because this is a, a divine union. This is a, um, uh, what am I trying to say? This is a, I, I don't know what, um, what I'm trying to say, but it's a divine union, a divine connection, a spiritual connection. It's um, an ordained connection, ordained by spirit, okay, by your ancestors, okay? They approve of this union, and it's going to be highly protected here, both of you. Yeah, Nine of Pentacles, okay? Oh, my gosh. Nine of Pentacles with the sun card here. Um, this is, yeah, you got nine of coins here showing up twice. Okay. So very, lots of abundance, lots of happiness, lots of abundance, lots of wish fulfillment, lots of, lots of success. Okay. In this union. Okay. And I'm talking success in emotionally, financially, whatever, 1424, I just saw on the timer guys, like, Lots of lots of stability, lots of happiness, lots of abundance, lots of um, reciprocity, okay? Lots of love, lots of emotion, lots of caring both ways from you and this person. Like equal give and take. I'm getting reciprocity. Yeah, there's that six of pentacles. Equal give and take. <laughs> 
There it is. Page of Swords. This is this is a divinely orchestrated union. I think that's what I was trying to say earlier. Okay. This is a divinely orchestrated union. This is somebody who has been seeing you or has been watching you. They like um, the way you move. They think that you're a very giving, loving, loyal person. Okay. Um, like I said, if you haven't, if you're not with this person already, and you haven't met them already, then they're coming. 1515 on the timer, guys. Okay. Um, you have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy. This could be you or them. Um, you have Leo here. Okay. Oh my gosh. You got, um, Sagittarius energy here. Like shit, y'all, y'all, whoever it is for you. But yeah, this is what's happening. This person is ready for equal give and take. Okay. Six of Pentacles. All right. This is going to be a very much reciprocated, <laughs> reciprocal relationship. Okay. Everything that you have to give or everything that you always give or always put into a relationship. Okay. You always give it your all. This person is going to do the same thing. You got the Hierophant showing up here again, okay? This person could want to give you a ring. I'm hearing this person could eventually want to propose to you down the road, all right? Queen of Pentacles is here. Yeah, you guys have done some healing, okay? You're very, very strong. This person sees you as very strong as well, okay? Like you've gone through a lot of things, yeah. This person sees you as very strong. They decided that they want you. They decided that you are their wish fulfillment. Do you hear me? They're not playing. They're being very selfish about you. They want to hold on to you. They've decided that you... Child, I cannot. The judgment, the four of pentacles, the seven of cups, the star, and the lovers. Listen. Yeah, this person walked away from a from a very toxic, burdensome situation, or they've been healing from this situation, right? They've been healing... Um, from a past life, I mean, past love situation from an ex here, okay? But now they're ready. Now they're ready to be all about you. And this person is going to be selfish about you. I'm, I'm trying to tell you, okay? They, they're not going to play. Or they don't play about you. Take whatever resonates, okay? Present or future. But they, they don't play about you. They love you. Can I get one more for this Ace of Cups, please? Uh, this is lovely. I love it. I love it. Look, justice. I told y'all this is your karmic destiny, okay? This is... <laughs> I can't even... I can't even. Like, you guys could be a Libra. You have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy here. Okay, you are this person. But whatever this is, things are about to start balancing out in your life, okay? We saw that earlier with the um, temperance card in the other deck. Yep, and look, damn it, there's a temperance card right there. <laughs> I can't even make it up. Sagittarius energy here, okay? 1818 on the timer. Y'all, I can't even make it up. Things are coming into balance for you. Things are working out in your favor. I'm telling you, I'm hearing it's been a long, hard road. It's been a long journey, but things are finally about to start happening for you. You are about to see movement in your life in a positive direction here, okay? Sagittarius energy here. Um, somebody feels like they missed out on an opportunity with you. You could have ended something with someone or you rejected someone's, um, advances or something, but somebody feels sad because, um, they feel like they missed their opportunity with you. Okay. Um, but yeah, but page of, so page of wands here on the split, you got good news coming in. Okay. You got news coming in page of wands communication coming in. What's coming in is the, a new beginning here. The full card is showing up again, okay? Y'all done had some doubled up energy, all right? You got the Eight of Wands showing up twice, the Ten of Cups showing up twice, the Nine of Coins showed up twice here, okay? Spirit ain't playing with y'all. This is you about to have a passionate new daggone beginning here, Ace of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy, okay? Gemini energy, I'm getting Virgo, Pisces, okay? Somebody, oh my gosh, every time. I'm not going to give this person any energy right now. I can't. 
because you guys are about to be happy in the union and of course there's going to be somebody in behind the scenes trying to cause some sort of drama and some bullshit but we're not even going to get into that right now we're going to keep it pushing and clarify this ten of cups here okay no negativity in this reading today we'll save that for the next one <laughs> what's the ten of cups here no weapon formed against me shall prosper. It won't work. It's the Ten of Cups. Oh my goodness. All right. King of Swords here. Gemini energy. So it could be a uh, Gemini that's coming in for you guys. You guys could be a Gemini. Lots of communication here. Like this, um, this is going to be someone who is very good at communicating. Okay. Um, someone who likes to talk to you, someone who likes to hear what you have to say. Okay. Reciprocity is here again. Six of Pentacles. This is somebody who wants to know you, wants to love you, wants to reciprocate all the feelings that you have for them. They're going to, you know, you're going to be able to feel it. It's going to be equal. You're going to be able to feel it. You're going to be able to tell. It's going to be a perfect balance in you guys' relationship. No one person is going to feel like it's one-sided, like I love them more than they love me, or I'm putting in more effort than they're putting in. Like, it's not going to be like that, okay? It's not going to be like that. You got the High Priestess and the Ace of Swords here. Oh, my goodness gracious. Somebody knows that this is a um, highly protected and divine union, right? But there's somebody who's very much in their head about this. Somebody could be trying to do some sort of manipulation. Here you have the Five of Swords and the Magician card with the Ten of Pentacles. Somebody's going to try to do some sort of ugh, shit in your relationship to cause some sort of drama or to try to cause you to break up. I'm getting um, somebody's going to try to cause some chaos and confusion in your relationship but that shit's gonna be blocked nine of wands here you ain't gotta worry about it seven of wands is here this like i said this union it's divinely orchestrated it's highly protected temperance just showed up on the split again whatever whoever is trying to send and bring negativity into this union they're gonna be dealt with accordingly so you ain't gotta worry about it okay nine of cups is here all right emotional fulfillment mm-hmm Yeah, somebody from your past that you walk away from or this person, they regret not taking an opportunity with you, okay? When they see this other person coming in, they're going to be like, oh, shit, I, I, oh, shit, I thought I had more time. I thought, you know, you were just going to sit and wait for me. I could just keep stringing you along. And now they're in their feelings because they missed an opportunity with you and you moved on. <laughs> oh, well, what's the king of swords here? I'm getting legal things as well could be going to the courthouse all right um somebody could be going to the courthouse to get some paperwork done whether this is um divorce paper so that they can move on with you or whether you guys are going to get your marriage license or whatever this is okay yeah i told you i told you somebody feels like they missed an opportunity with you you could have kicked somebody out or somebody moved out okay two of swords they couldn't um I don't know. They they in the four of cups. Yeah, this is just somebody who left or somebody that you walked away from or that you sent away from you or something like that. And they they couldn't I I heard they didn't see your worth. They didn't know your worth or they didn't see your worth. Okay, but now it's just too little too late. This person they know that they missed an opportunity with you. Okay. Could be a um Leo here. Aries Leo Sagittarius here. Okay. Could be a Cancer, Gemini, <clears throat> or Virgo. Okay. What's this Nine of Coins? Can I find a Nine of Coins for me, please? Shit. 
get. I'm telling you, can't make it up. You about to get a victory, a win. It's a yes for me. Okay. Spirit says, yeah, nine of coins. All of this drama and chaos and everything that you've been through is about to be worth it. You're about to start seeing how much it's worth it. Okay. You about to get a win here. Um, I'm also getting platforms. Somebody's business or whatever could be doing very well as well. Okay. That's the six of wands. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Magician. Okay. This is something that you guys have manifested. You guys have been manifesting a new beginning, a new love. Okay. Somebody's very heartbroken over, over you. Okay. The hangman keeps wanting to come out. Somebody is trying to stop this union. They're trying to stop your will of fortune. They're trying to stop your destiny, your divine union right here that we just started off with. Somebody's trying to come in and manipulate this and trying to stop it here, okay? Could be a Pisces, could be a Gemini, Virgo energy, okay? Could be a Scorpio, uh, Virgo, Taurus, or a Capricorn here, okay? Or a Cancer. But somebody wants, doesn't want this to happen for you. Okay, they want to put an end to your divine union connection, whatever this is, whenever it happens, or this is currently happening right now, all because you walked away from them, or either because they regret walking away from you. Okay, and it's like now they want to try to come back or do whatever, but that shit ain't gonna work. Nine of Wands, it, it's blocked, it's over, it's over. Okay. You got the Ten of Pentacles with the Sun and the Four of Wands and the Nine of Pentacles here in the Strength card. Listen, they're not stopping nothing, okay? They're trying to block all of this happiness and abundance for you, but it's coming anyway. It's coming anyway. Yeah, Five of Swords, they're in their head, okay? Because I just heard, I uh, can't touch this, okay? Can't touch this. Yeah, they can't touch you. It's over. They're all up in their head because you are divinely protected here because your union is divinely protected. They can't penetrate this bubble and they can't bother you. So now they all up in their daggone head trying to figure out who, why, what the fuck, you know what I'm saying? But they need to really take some time and reflect and go inward because you guys have done the healing, okay? And that is why you're about to get this celebration here. Your angels and spirit and your ancestors are telling you you did good, all right? You deserve this. Somebody's trying to stop your abundance. But again, look, you got temperance, seven of pentacles, and the seven of cups here. This dog room, first of all, you guys are highly protected. This temperance card, this angel, um, I'm hearing Michael, okay? This card has popped up about four, five, six times, okay? I don't even know how many times. 2808, I just saw on the timer. But they're saying that the seeds that you have planted, okay, they're about to come into fruition. They're about to start growing, okay? All of these um, wishes are about to be fulfilled. They're about to start growing, okay? All of these seeds that you planted, all this manifestation, 2828 on the timer, it's about to start happening, okay? You are divinely guided and divinely protected here. And yeah, seven of cups here. Oh, seven, seven. Okay. Um, shit. <laughs> yeah. I'm hearing that your, your, your spirit guides, they don't play about you either, okay? And I'm hearing that they're telling whoever this person is, find you somebody else to play with, okay? I heard that clear as day. Find you somebody else to play with, okay? They they not having it. Mm. Why, is the, why is the fool card here? Why is the fool card here? Okay. So Page of Swords came out blocked. Okay. Page of Swords is that energy of somebody watching you, somebody spying on you, somebody stalking you, somebody trying to see what's going on. Okay. It's blocked. Okay. Um, 
Yeah, because you're protected. Seven of Wands. So whatever this person's trying to do, whatever they're trying to see, whatever they're trying to know, whatever they're trying to manipulate, you guys are protect protected. What? <laughs> are protected this new beginning okay this fool this leap of faith that you're about to take this new beginning that you're about to have don't worry about it okay ain't nobody gonna be able to come in between that nine of cups here on the bottom of the deck emotional fulfillment you're winning age of pentacles you got news coming in that this is your wish fulfillment all right so uh, the star card here and the strength card you guys have been strong you've navigated um oh i, I heard you've navigated the, your obstacles beautifully, okay? You've navigated your obstacles beautifully. Will of Fortune on the top. That's why your, your destiny is coming to you. Yeah, there's that fool card. There's the Empress. I mean, come on. Come on. I can't. Child. Let's get some uh, tea leaf oracles for you guys real quick. And then I'm going to be out. I got to go get my charge. Again, guys, if you're still here with me, 3131 on the timer, please go ahead and hit those like, share, and subscribe buttons. I would greatly appreciate it. Okay. It also helps me to pick up on your energy so that I could get, oh, look, August. August on this play. I just looked down. August, new home and new attitude. So somebody could be getting ready to move into a new home here in August. Okay. Or I'm hearing by this time next year, you'll be in a new home. That was a broom. I'm also hearing jump the broom. So I'm hearing by this time next year, some of you guys are going to be in a new home, a new connection, a new um, uh, uh, a new family. So you could be combining families with somebody. Baby. Okay. But yeah, y'all go ahead and hit those like, share, subscribe buttons for me, please. And if you need a personal, please remember that the information will be below. All right, let's see. I wasn't planning on this reading being this long, y'all, but you know. Just do as I'm told, honey. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, okay y'all. I don't know why I just heard this. And I don't think it got nothing to do with this reading, but it must be for somebody specific. I just heard possession is nine-tenths of the law. All right. So I'm getting that somebody could have uh, left something at your house. I just said something earlier about somebody being kicked out or moved out or whatever. So somebody could have left some property at your house that they're trying to get. But I feel like it's been there for like a really long time at 3303 on the timer. And I think it's on. they're being petty. OK, let me just say that they're just being petty <laughs> for whatever reason. <laughs> I don't know who that was for, but yeah. Petty as good because <laughs> you could have moved in with somebody, or somebody could have moved in with you, okay. And I don't know, I guess somebody's whoever you were with before is realizing, like, hey, I left something there, or and then somebody's like, I threw that shit in the trash. <laughs> I don't know who the fuck that's for, who I'm channeling right now, but yeah, I'm getting the whole conversation like somebody's like, oh, I left. Such and such there, you know, they're just being petty because they know you with somebody and then you're like, man, I threw that shit in the trash. It's gone. You, you're more than welcome to go fish it out the trash or it's on the curb or something like that. Uh, I don't know who that's for. Okay, guys, let me finish this. <laughs> um, So if it's somebody that's watching and you're wondering where your stuff at, then it's probably in the trash or on the curb. All right. So just saying. Or somebody saying, no, this is, my, this is mine now. You left it here. It's been here forever. It's mine now. Okay? <laughs> what y'all got going on? All right. So the very top of the daggone deck, you have success. All right? Can't argue with that. You got um, increase in material wealth or spiritual growth. Amen. Ashe. Claim it. Okay. You got hidden secrets can harm you. Mm. 
Okay, you have unsuccessful outcome to a problem. You are on the right path regarding some aspect of your life. Excuse me. You could be feeling tied down or frustrated in this moment. Okay. Um, you have a new job and career. Involvement with the law. Yeah, Gabo. I said somebody could have some court situations going on or some sort of... Um, hmm. Somebody's not telling the truth about something and I feel like it has something to do with court with this hidden secrets can harm you somebody's not telling like the truth I don't know what that is but all right you got um dark woman's dealings or a relationship with the woman with dark complexion or hair all right um heartache over what you no longer have yeah that's this person that's whoever this is that's trying to come in and fuck your situation up okay they have heartache over um what they no longer have okay there's an announcement here and then you have reconciliation. So you could be reconciling with somebody or somebody wants to reconcile with you. You could also be coming into reconciliation with your, um, reconciling with some, a past life soulmate. Okay. Not an ex, but a past life soulmate, or this is an ex who wants to come in and reconcile with you because they are heartbroken because they no longer have you. Okay. Take what resonates. You have opportunities are waiting for you. New doors are opening. You have flowers, which is happiness. Okay, lots of happiness. A position of authority here. Okay, you guys, you guys are moving up into a higher level position, whether it's in your job, whether it's in your love life. Okay, somebody's getting the title, Mister um, Miseries, somebody. Okay, or somebody's getting a new title in their job. Okay, take what resonates. Oh. oh, oh. You have a box. You will receive a gift. Yeah. Strong emotion, passionate love, or hate. Take what resonates. Okay? You have a change for the better, baby. Yeah? Unsettled times. Need to plan ahead. Okay? Um, You have someone will try to make you do something against your will here. Yeah. This... Mm-mm. Uh, somebody's going to try to change your mind about something or make you change your mind or something. I don't know. Okay. You have a long journey, either physical or mental will leave you wiser at the end. So whatever happens, you guys are going to be the wiser for it. Pay attention to your finances. You have news on the way and temporary problems. Okay. So whatever the problems are, it's temporary. Don't worry about it. Pay attention to your finances. All right, let's get some love oracle messages for you. True love on the split. This is the romance of a lifetime. Lots of passion. She's gone. Okay, guys, what are the messages here? Holy Spirit, what is left here? Let's get some, about four, five cards. What are the messages? <laughs> All right, oh dang, how many is that? That's four. Okay. It says positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Yeah, so y'all have faith. That this is coming to you. You have to have the faith, all right? Attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Yeah. I'm hearing that song. I'm living my best life, okay? Just by being you, just by enjoying yourself, loving yourself, and being your true self, you guys are attracting in romance, okay? You're, you're attracting in positivity just by being you, okay? You ain't got to do nothing, you have this light energy and this protection around you, okay? You don't have to do anything. Just get up and go outside. Go to the grocery store. Like, just be you wherever you go. You're going to attract some, some romantic people, okay? Some people you may not want. 39.39 on the timer, but it's okay. You don't have to try too hard. You don't have to do anything extra. Just be you, okay? 
It says, um, honestly discuss your feelings with each other, have heart to heart conversations, and very soon. Okay, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Very soon. Let's do one more thing, guys. I'm going to get um time oracle deck. Let's see how long until this union happens. How long for this divine union to happen? Let's get about three or four cards. Holy Spirit, can you tell us how long? When can? Wow. Within six months for some of you. This one wants to come out. Okay. Not within six months. It says no here. I don't know what you just asked in your head, but the answer is no. Maybe not within six months. Or whatever, or the answer is no to some question. I'm hearing some person. Maybe somebody was just thinking, like, is it this person? Okay. I don't know. All right. So when? Okay. Well, this is very broad. All right. You have within five years, within two years, and within two weeks. Okay. So... Y'all take what resonates there, and I'm going to leave it there, and I hope something helped you guys out, okay? Please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. Personal reading information will be in the description box below, and I'll see y'all next time, okay? Love, light, peace, prosperity, and abundance to all of you. Peace, guys.